Hello there, everybody, and welcome back to Pokemon X. Last time, we explored around Laver City and did some progress on items that we missed and did some Battle Chateau stuff, now that we're a Countess. Today, we're going to head straight into the breach. This is Laver City Gym. Bug-eyed freak? Actually, no, she's not a freak. Laver City Pokemon Gym. Leader, Valerie. And I totally forgot to read the sign. A maiden. The maiden from a land with history. That doesn't say anything about her type of Pokemon. Well, howdy, Miss Pouty. I'm not Miss Pouty. What's new, future champ? This here Laver City Pokemon Gym has truly confounding conundrums. The first shocker here, that this is a fairy type gym. Bet you've never seen one of these before. The second shocker is how you get around. Hop on one of these warp panels and off you go. But where you'll land, nobody knows. Ha, just pulling your leg, champ. The warp panel's all at fixed destinations, of course. So go on, step on the flashing yellow panel. The classic warp puzzle, eh? So I kinda like how I kinda like how the fact when you zoom out. It just shows you, like, this this view of all the rooms, kind of like a dollhouse. That's kind of cool. It's really cool. And, of course, I want to fight every single one of these because these are unique uh, class of trainers. The Furisude Girls. And, in case you weren't aware already, this is a Fairy-type gym. Fairy-type Pokémon, once again, they're the new type added to Generation 6. They are immune to all Dragon-type moves, and they are strong against Dragons. And I'm so glad I picked Magical Leap just now! And I'm so glad that I that you were able to tank that. Yep, I'm so glad about that fact. <laughs> All right, so when it comes to, uh, well, actually no, when it doesn't come to anything, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know anything about Pokemon. I swear, I've only been playing for you know the past uh, like nearly 30 years. Jeez. This franchise is almost 30 years old. Level 35. I'm gonna bring in Dedenne again. Bring in Dedenne one more time. Before the end. Ah. Oh. Jeez. That didn't kill. Okay. All right, cool. Go ahead and rest. Go ahead and do that. Because then you'll be rudely awakened by Seed Bomb. Surprised I wasn't even a crit. Oh, God. <laughs> um, bye. Die while you're asleep. That's a horrible way to go. So strong. So beautiful. He's like, ah, the sea. So fascinating. So beautiful. Ah. <laughs> I believe every one of these rooms, if I remember right, has a trainer that you can fight. So we're going to fight. We're going to fight most of them. And hey, baby, how you doing? Aromatisse. I believe you are a Pokemon Y exclusive Pokemon. So that's pretty interesting. So that's pretty interesting, man. That's pretty interesting. Unfortunately, when it comes to offensive towards um, offensive attacks towards uh, Fairy type Pokemon, I don't think I have any. Yeah, I don't think I have any. Unless we wait until Katana learns a Steel type move. I don't have any poison types. I don't have any poison. Yeah, I don't have any poison type moves with me, so. This could lead to an interesting time. 
with me being able to try to counter all of that. Either way, that was Moonblast, basically the equivalent of... Yeah, the... Yeah, the basic. Oh. Wait. No, 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 no. No, no, no. What have I done? What have I done? What have I done? Very strong against fighting. What have I done? What have I done? I realized, like, way too late. Ah! Okay, maybe I'm starting to think experience here was a good idea after all. <laughs> yeah, it was the best... It was actually the best idea, actually. Jeez, Aroma Tea... It's like... Jeez. Aroma Tea was way more defensive than I thought. In fact... In fact... A mobilized by level, of course. Can't do anything. In fact, let me actually look at this. A mobile eye Of course! Of course! Oh god! <laughs> ah! Alright. Take a look at the base stat. What? Okay, so I'm looking at the base stats of uh, Aromatis right now, and it's and it's only and it's only 72 defense, physical defense, 90, 89 uh, special defense. That shouldn't be a problem. I wonder why it is. <laughs> I don't know, but thankfully. I was able to avoid that shit. All right. So, level 36 for Rose Storm. Psyche got to level 41 and wants to learn Air Slash. Finally, a good, uh, a good move. If I instantly regret that, <laughs> I'm gonna learn. Whoa, Lady Valerie, I need your help. <laughs> Yeah, he's going to heal! He's going to heal! Healed up my mons. So let's keep going. Well, I'm fighting all the rooms with all the trainers already. <laughs> Man, this is going to be one... This is going to be one uh, interesting gym. Hey, baby, how you doing? Unless you're... Unless you're in there. Anyway. <laughs> um, Blossom! That's kind of an interesting uh, thing. But also, the more interesting thing is a Pokemon that's literally keys. What? I know, that's crazy, man. <laughs> They'll make Pokemon out of anything these days. I mean, at the time anyway, but... Yeah, they'll make a Pokemon out of anything these days. A Pokemon that's literally a key holder. How wacky. Is it really any different than a Pokemon that's just a bunch of eggs? Or is it any different than a Pokemon that's just a rock with arms? Or is it any different than just a Pokeball with a face? Or is it any different than a Pokemon that, that's ice cream? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, man. But what I do know is Katana got to level 42. Grand Ball. Grand Ball. All right. So I'm going to send in Rose Thorn for the experience. And then I'm going to bring in King for the uh, good stuff. Unless they have a move that kills me, then I might be good. Roar. Okay. <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> wow. You just go. You. You, you just. You, it just went full circle all the way back to Psych, man. I. I don't understand. I don't understand random chances at all. Man. Thirty-seven. Thirty-nine. Curlia. 
yeah, so this is basically your opportunity to learn which Pokemon are now fairy types and which ones aren't the aren't participants in the fairy type uh, stuff. 44 for King. You're no doll. You're a true Pokemon trainer. I am a true Pokemon's trainer. That's that's how it goes. Wow, I'm getting like really lucky with all this. <laughs> normally I don't have normally I don't have so much luck with with like all of this. Do you know a certain type of Pokemon have move or a certain type of move has no effect on Slurpuff. This is the evolved form of Swirlix. And is uh only an X. I'm gonna check Slurpuff's stats to see if I'm... Okay. Only 86 defense and 75 special defense, so... Barring anything that might possibly happen... I think we're okay? Maybe? I mean... <laughs> unless that's... Unless, like, I missed a lot of things and... Miss the fact that Slurpuff and maybe Aromatisi. Aromatisi has a. Uh... No! They don't have high HP stat. I mean, 82 is a high HP stat. But, like. Huh? Anyway, um. You know that Whip Dream we have? So. Whenever you trade a Swirlix that has a Whip Dream, that means oh nope nope no 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 no. That means um uh trading Swirlix with a holding while holding Whip Dream can have it evolve into Slurpuff. And I believe the opposite is true with the Satchel that we that you can get in this game for uh the Pokemon Spritzy to evolve into Romatisse. So that's a thing that happens and is now level 38. Aromatherapy. Aromatherapy is an interesting move. So it heals all status conditions affecting the user's party, which can be useful. Maybe. Well, if you have, if you don't have, if you don't have already, if you don't already have like a bunch of status restoring items already. I mean, you can already buy full heals at this point, so I don't th think it's really an issue. But aromatherapy's there if you really want to use it. Speaking of using things... Foul play. Yes. Yes. Yas. Yeah, boy! Crocodile! I love this thing. <laughs> yeah, so turns out level 40 was the evolution level that um, Croc Rock needed, so that was the rare candy indeed. And would you look at that? <laughs> I got like, okay, to be fair, I got like extremely, extremely lucky with that, so. Ooh, I don't have anything that could possibly counter her lead. I mean, it's fine either. I mean, it's fine either way, I suppose. Maybe. <laughs> I mean, famous last words before I do indeed die, but we'll see. Now we get to the very first fairy type gym leader. Oh, if it isn't a young trainer. So you've flown all the way here through my gym, fluttering down to me on the fortunate wind. Then I suppose you've earned yourself the right to the battle as a reward for your efforts. I am Valerie, who leads this very tight gym. I hope your visit will prove entertaining to you. The elusive fairy types may appear frail as a breeze and delicate as a bloom, 
but they are strong. Nice way to wrap up a speech. She leads with Mawile and not the Mega version. Level 38 Steel Fairy type Hyper Cutter for its ability, which means its attack can't be lowered. And it's got the moves Faint Attack, Crunch, and Iron Defense. Here's what I'm going to do. It might be risky, but at the same time, it can actually work to my advantage. So, Mawile's attacking moves are both Dark type. So, if I can power up Punch and boost my attack, just constantly use it over and over and over again, then I'll be able to just maybe possibly sweep the rest of our team with CJ. Crunch and Feigned Attack can't really do anything toward me. And besides, I think um, Summer... I think at least one other Pokemon of hers has, you know, a physical attack. While the Pokemon she's most likely going to send out next only has a special attacks. I mean, those um, defense nerfs are going to lead up to something. Possibly. Because it seems, it just seemed like it was going to happen every single time, man. <laughs> Which is funny. But, there you go. She stunned Iron Defense as best as she can, as she could. And that might be my fifth or sixth. Because stats can only go up to plus six while a Pokemon is out. Or minus six. Okay, let's see how this goes. Mr. Mime. Level 39 Psychic Fairy type. Soundproof for their ability. Which, for, which, which means sound type attacks won't work. Light screen reflect. Um, psychic and dazzling gleam. I'm... I'm really worried about that light screen and reflect. And I'm also really worried about the fact that both of its attacking moves can do serious damage to CJ. Thankfully, I'm not worried anymore. <laughs> yes. Yes. Bulk up. Should I? I mean, I know I always consider before saying no. <laughs> nah. Sylveon. This is Eevee's new evolution, and it looks great. <laughs> I really like the design of Sylveon. I really do. So before it inevitably dies, uh, 40, level 42, fairy type, cute charm for the ability, which means if you make direct contact with it, if you are the opposite gender, then it has a 30% chance of, of attracting you. Dazzling Gleam, Quick Attack, Swift, and Charm. Now it's done. <laughs> it's done. Damn. <laughs> I hope the sun is shining tomorrow. That would be reason enough to smile. Sure it would. <laughs> yes, that was a fine battle. Yeah, I set up and I smacked it down. <laughs> I shall reward you for this great victory. This is the fairy badge. It is yours now. Its beauty is captivating, is it not? Ah, uh, do forgive me. I was so captivated, I forgot for a moment that it is yours. That is indeed a fairy shape. This captivating fairy badge will endear any Pokemon up to level 30 to you. 
Yes, only those po Pokemon that you may receive from others will obey you. I also wish to award you this TM. Consider it a personal gift from me, not simply the winnings of a battle. TM99 Dazzling Gleam. So, Dazzling Gleam, she didn't really get to use. But, Dazzling Gleam is a move that I've been looking forward to. You wait, I've always wanted to be a Pokemon, you see. That desire is my inspiration for what I try to achieve by designing. And yet, the only time when I feel I'm truly one with Pokemon is when we are embroiled in desperate battle. I wonder why that is. Hmm. Could it be... Never mind, it is nothing, kind trainer. Also, I don't care what anybody says. Ash versus Valerie was cool. Trick room strategy, my ass. <laughs> um, but yeah, no. Uh, she, her arms are act. The interesting thing about Valerie is that her arms are actually in her. Yo, we have become one. <laughs> actually, her arm. The, she looks like she has no arms, but her wing type things are actually her arms. Her arms are just covered in them. Like, those are just incredibly long sleeves, which I think it's, like, really funny. Uh, yeah, it's, it's just really funny to think about. Those, are, those aren't wings. Those are actual arms. Hey, it's the Fairy Badge. It's so cute and sparkly. You know what? We're going to tour the Pokeball Factory. Come with us. I'm interested in Pokeballs because they're used to catch Pokemon. No duh, genius. To put it in another way, I'm utterly fascinated by them. Well, uh, good luck with that. I mean, we'll be able to join them soon enough anyway, so it's cool. <laughs> Either way, that was unbelievably easy. <laughs> I didn't even get a chance to, like, go over my alterations. Like, okay. So, Mega Mawile as a lead because gym leaders are apparently really stupid and not realizing that Mega Evolution exists. Uh, Mr. Mime having Light Screen and Reflect can actually be really good. And... And Psychic and Dazzling Gleam, Gleam to do that would definitely help out in the long run. Um, I might actually break the rules here and be a little bit of a dick. Um, and say, uh, Florges as another Pokemon that could attack. Could be just a pure offensive Pokemon. To go along with uh, Sylveon as yet another attacker. And also support. And Spice. <laughs> So yeah, that, those would be my alterations. Because again, gym leaders don't know don't know shit about Mega Evolution except for Karina. La no, not last time. Next time on Pokemon X, I guess we're just, uh, you know, yeah, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna. <laughs> I can't talk. Why can't I talk? Why can't I talk, man? It, it's so stupid. Why can't I talk? We're going to tour the Pokeball Factory with Shauna and Trevor, but good luck with that because there's a Team Flare guy coming in there. See you guys on the next time. Thank you for watching, and goodbye. Oh my god, I, I should stop recording before.